Welcome to IPO Calendar, please like and subscribe. Frontier Group Holdings, an ultra-low-cost U.S. airline carrier that serves approximately 110 airports, is expected to go public on April 1st. The Denver, Colorado-based company plans to raise $600 million by offering 30 million shares, 50% insider, at a price range of $19 to $21. At the midpoint of the proposed range, Frontier Group Holdings would command a fully diluted market value of $4.5 billion. CD, Barclays, Deutsche Bank, Morgan Stanley, Evercore ISI, Bank of America Securities, JP Morgan, Namira Securities, and UBS Investment Bank are joint bookrunners on the deal. Product Frontier offers flights throughout the U.S. and to select near international destinations in the Americas. Its revenue comes from the fair sensitive customers in the market. Founders Frontier is run by Barry Biffle, a Spirit Airlines veteran, and the airline is owned by experienced, low cost airline investor Bill Frank and Indigo Partners. Market size Global low cost carrier, LCC, market is projected to reach USD 247.36 billion by 2025, expanding at a compound annual growth rate of 8.62% between 2019 and 2025. The market opportunity for ultra-low-cost travel in North America is expected to bounce back as the pandemic wanes due to increasing vaccinations. Business Model Low-cost airlines minimize operations costs to offer the cheapest tickets possible. The firm seeks primarily leisure customers from its three largest bases of Denver, Orlando, and Las Vegas. Competitors Sun Country Airlines is an American ultra-low-cost passenger and cargo airline and the 11th largest in the U.S. by passengers carried. ExpressJet is a North American regional airline partially owned by United Airlines and Mana Air LLC. Spirit Airlines is an American ultra-low-cost carrier headquartered in Murmur, Florida in the Miami metropolitan area. Spirit operates scheduled flights throughout the U.S. and in the Caribbean and Latin America. Financials Frontier Group Holdings booked $1.3 billion in revenue for the 12 months ended December 31, 2020. Frontier has received at least $486 million from investors including Indigo Frontier Holdings, Indigo Denver Management, and others. However, it should be considered that a possible risk to the firm's outlook is consumers hesitating to travel in large numbers as 2021 progresses. To keep track of this stock before and after IPO, Get latest updates on upcoming IPO, quiet periods, new filings and more stock info and analysis. Download the IPO Calendar app, click the link in the description.